All right. I wanted to do a final review on Henry Rose. Um, unfortunately, I did not find any of them to be for me. Um, they smell lovely, except for Fog. Fog doesn't smell. I just, I can't recommend Fog for anything. But, um, but all of them were were decent smells. They just didn't make my cut. Um, but for any of you that are thinking and watching my candid videos of me reacting to, uh, well, me spraying myself with perfume, um, that is my first initial reaction. Now, I do want to say that maybe what I smell may not be what you smell. Everybody smells things and tastes things differently. Um, so I want to encourage you guys. I know that you watch videos so that you don't have to buy it <laughs> and try it. Um, but sometimes you just, with perfume, oh, it's with perfume, you just kind of have to. Um, and, uh, and I hate to say that, but um, you know, I may hate something or dislike something and you buy it and then you're like, oh, well, I think it smells good. So, um, it's to each his own, but I just want to break down the smells to you. So Jake's house is a universal, um, it can be for man or woman. Uh, it smells great. Um, I really enjoyed it until it got down to the musk note. Uh, but then after that, it, you know, um, it went away. Uh, the ones that go away the fastest would be sheep's clothing does not last. I did spray that on myself today. That was the top contender if I was going to purchase any of these perfumes, it would have been sheep's clothing, but after an hour, I could not smell it on myself anymore. Um, so that is just a no for me. And I wasn't really sold on it, to be honest. It was just kind of like, well, if I have to pick one, then I would settle for that one. Um, and then, uh, Smythe was the one that had the granny apple smell. Uh, it was quite sheer and, um, it, it was a nice smell. It just didn't do anything for me. Uh, and I just, you know, I just was like, no, I'm not impressed. Um, fog, we all know the story on fog. Don't need to go there again. Floral, uh, the floral conivara. That one, of course, is a floral. It literally says it's floral, um, and it is. It's floral, uh, but again, it just reminded me of a different floral that I've smelled before, so it was nothing exciting. Now, here's the other clue that I just kind of, you know, thought of. These might not be original scents. They may be because the whole, the real, the real bread and butter here is that they're safe for you to wear. So if you have, let's say a perfume that smells like this and you get this perfume and it smells similar, you will like it because it has the same notes or it's kind of like similar. Um, but this is cleaner. This is a clean and safe ver uh, version of a perfume that maybe you might have worn before. Um, so this is just, it's non-toxic. So that, that's what it really is here. They're not trying to recreate anything. Uh, we figured it out. We figured it out. Henry Rose is not trying to recreate, I mean, is not trying to create new smells. They're just trying to recreate smells that are familiar so that you can get a safer product 
uh, with something that is smells familiar, maybe from another perfume line. Henry Rose, I figured you out. So if you want something that is spicy, oh, we're on florals, excuse me. Flora Conavara is a floral, it definitely is. Windows Down is not categorized as floral, but it came off as floral to me. Um, because it, it says right here, has a floral finish. That's why. Um, so those are gonna be the two florals. That's it. There's no other florals in this line. Um, and then we have, then we have uh, the deeper boss lady smells, which are going to be dark as night. That's very sensual, very deep. Torn, very dark and deep. Last night, again, deep. Queen, queens and monsters. Again, deep. All of these have the all of these say smooth woody effect, woody aroma, vanilla bean, spicy, and then char. Again, that one is woody and smoky. Um, those are going to be your fall and winter smells. And they all smell very similar to each other, to be honest. I mean, after a while, you're like, which one is that? <laughs> because dark is night, and last night, they all mimic each other. They all have that spicy, uh, they, they just have spice in them. All of them have that deep wood spice, and they all smell particularly the same to me honestly. Um, may, they might have one or two notes that are tweaked, but that's very, very, very fine line there. Um, so all of those that I just named off, those are going to be the ones that you might be looking for right now. So on their website, they have fresh and then they have warm. Um, Pick the one that you wanted to try. I know that they split them up kind of weird. Uh, I think char comes in both sets, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, but for $24, you get that little cigarette pack. <laughs> Let me get it. You get this little cigarette pack for 24 bucks. And one, two, three, four. Four of them come in. I think four of them fit in here. Let me see. Let me see. Four of them. Four of them come. Yeah. I'm smelling one of them right now. Four of them come in here for 24. That's not bad. But, you know, some things, honestly, some things you just have to experience it for yourself. But uh, I will still be looking for perfume. I'm really tempted. Uh, it looks like I got a little something in my hair, but it's not. Um, I am still tempted to get a different perfume that I smelled in another video. Very tempted. Very tempted. Um, so I don't know. I'm still looking for me. Uh, and yeah, but none of these did it. None of these did it for me. And um, I say if you want to try it, you should try it. I mean, $45 on, thir on 11 of these if you get the whole set. Uh, so you can smell what I smelled. And I would love for y'all to just go ahead and buy it. Just go ahead and get both both cigarette box sets and and just give it a whirl and see if I'm wrong and then come back and post on here and tell me say you know what 
I did smell Queens and Monsters and I liked it. And I'd be like, well, then we don't have the same taste. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, that would be really fun. But, you know, not everybody has money to blow and y'all have bills to pay. And I, I understand that. So it's very important that I do, that I do this uh, correctly and explain things to you guys the way I know how. So, all right, that is it. Case closed on Henry Rose. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next videos.